yo man so today we are going to be improving our car movement today and uh, first of all we are going to be uh, the the wheel uh, the wheels are actually skidding a lot it looks like the it's uh, moving on an ice surface or something uh, but it should look like uh, on the grass surface it should move like so and also when we are moving forward and press the reverse key it does not act instantly and same with when we are reversing it and press the forward key and it takes a lot of time to act on that so we have to fix that too for a better movement so first of all we are going to be um, go to the rear wheel colliders and Im increase the forward friction stiffness to 3 just the rear wheel vehicles uh, rear wheel colliders um, and see if it works uh, it's going forward it slows down not instantly but it take less time now so it does not it does not uh, work like this but just changing one variable uh, to something and you will not get everything you want with your car so for that we have to do a lot of things like to make it slow we just see if we change the drag of the vehicle does it slow down yeah it slows down it does not and now pressed yes it instantly stopped yeah so like we don't want to be this uh, from the very start like we don't want the vehicle to look uh, this slow all the time so we can change these values from the script and just make it something like 0 0.1 or something and this should be 3 and let's test one more time and it's not that and it's not yeah it's moving and it slows down instantly not instantly like it takes it take time but better than before so what we're going to do is uh, the moment does not look uh, real real uh, as uh, we want the we want the car to be like 0 to 100 in uh, some time like 0 to 10 in 1 second and 10 to 20 in 2 seconds like it uh, it should be some thing like takes take time to improve the speed it shouldn't be like 0 to 100 in one second or something like that it should be real so we are going to be creating a public what public float that should be current speed and we are going okay first of all we are going to movement we're going to create a function and put everything related to movement in this function the far end the, the car movement and the, st uh, the steer movement also in this function so what we are going to do is we are going to put a value in the current speed and determine and determine on that current speed we are going to decide if the wheels should move or not so that's what we, what we are going to do so current speed equal to um, the wheel collider any uh, the any rear wheel collider dot radius multiplied by wheel collider same wheel collider dot rpm into 60 divided by 1000 into math f dot pi so uh, then we round it as, as equal to math f dot round current speed so now if we check if the current speed is less than 
some value that will be like 500 float and and we want the rigid body this rigid this body should be the speed of this rigid body should be less than some variable so it does not like go all the way to 1000 and something like that so it looks when you're like pressing the forward button for like 10 20 minutes it should be it should stay at a constant speed at the end it shouldn't be like increasing all the way up so we want the rigid body dot velocity dot magnitude to be less than less than some variable like 60 float oh, sorry and we want that to be we want the vertical movement of this um, our vehicle to be in the if statement not the steer angle steer angle should be outside so uh, let's n just create a variable here public float um, maximum speed This should be like public float. Mm, let's create another one. Public float maximum magnitude. Uh, maximum magnitude. Yeah. So if the if the uh, let's just um, put some variables here. Yeah, speed should be like 500, magnitude should be like 60, okay. And we move here. So now it will improve the speed of the car, not like instantly. You can also check and all, but so in today we are going to just do this and in the next tutorial we will be turning the vehicle left and right smoothly better and it should be in the next video real soon Thank